peanut butter and jelly Mondays are a convenient way for students to grab lunch on the go. For Dylan Burns, a peanut butter and honey sandwich makes the perfect meal. It's convenient both because I'm poor and because, I mean, I'm in class right here, and, and so it's easy to step out and step back in. But a Fort Worth health inspector says the disciples on campus do not have a health permit. They are actually doing a, a very good job. They just did not have a permit. In 2009, a Fort Worth health inspector almost shut down peanut butter and jelly Mondays, citing open containers of peanut butter and jelly and no place for students to wash their hands. Hand sanitizer is provided, but according to Fort Worth health codes, that is not enough. It's not an acceptable way because it's not hand washing. However, the group does take some precautions when serving food. One of the things that one of our students has to go through is the food handler's permit. We also cannot make the sandwiches for anybody. Health inspectors say bugs are a concern with open containers of food, but some students aren't worried. I'm pretty sure actually what they give me is probably better than what I have in, in my apartment. Just an occupational hazard, I guess, of being a student with getting access to free food. Even with the health concerns, on Monday, students just have one thing on their minds. It's peanut butter jelly time! Peanut butter jelly time! Peanut butter jelly time! It was great. <laughs> Kendall Morris, TCU News Now.